Hello! In this short video, I'm going to show you how you can create your own development course shell. Development course shells are used to stage your course. With a development course shell, you can begin in advance of the coming term to work on the courses uh, that you will be teaching at that time or in the further future. Once you have completed developing the course in this course shell, you will be able to copy that course into the official uh, course shell that is created when the web advisor synchronization occurs with Canvas. The process is simple. From your dashboard, the first thing we will look for is start a new course. It's recommended that you choose a name that will be easy to recall. As well, you can provide a short name, which will make it easy for you to look for it if you do not recall the long name. I recommend so that there are no spaces in your naming convention, you use underscores in between each word. Your content license should probably stay at private. This is a development shell, and there's no point at which students, teachers assistants, or any others without your express action will be enrolled in this. In addition, or related, it is best to leave the course invisible publicly. So once we have these, this information here, we'll create the course. We'll be sent straight to the development shell. If you visit the People tab from the navigation bar, you will see that you have already been added as the teacher for this course, and you are free to begin your development. If we return to the dashboard, you may see that this development shell has been added. If this is not what you would like to see, then you are free to go to Courses, All Courses. If the star is selected, deselect. Now you can see only the course which was there before is present. I can, however, continue to reach the development shell through the All Courses selection. Courses, All Courses. This course will not be used for teaching. It is used to develop and, pre and deploy your materials. It's a staging area. When the time comes for Southwestern College to create the official course shells, the shells into which students will be enrolled as they go through the registration process in WebAdvisor, you will be enrolled as instructor to the official course shell. And that course shell, you will want to head to Settings and Import Content to this course. From the Content Type dropdown, choose Copy a Canvas Course. I'm going to choose the Development Course Shell English 101, but it's also possible for me to simply search it using the Name field over on the right. Once I have selected this, I can now choose All Content. I can select certain content. I can adjust any dates that I may have set in the Development Shell. And then I can finally choose Import. Import will retrieve the content from the Development Core Shell and copy it to the official shell. That concludes the tutorial on creating your own development course shells. Thank you.